The man accused of beating an Albuquerque teen nearly to death in her West Side home was in court this morning with a list of requests for the judge. News 13's Fernanda Lopez was there. She's live at district court with what happened. Kim Justin Hansen is charged in the 2008 September beating of then Cibola High School student Brittany Marcel. Marcel and her family were in court this morning. Hansen's attorney is wanting key evidence excluded from trial. This includes the knife Hansen allegedly used to threaten Marcel's mom when she walked in on the attack, as well as the shovel police say Hansen used to beat Marcel with. Now, the, ev the defense argues the knife has since been destroyed and Hansen's DNA was not found on the shovel, so using those items as evidence would be unfair. Police arrested Hansen last July after his DNA came up as a match with it. DNA found from blood at the scene. Now, while that evidence was not brought up in court today, Hans's defense did ask the state to drop several charges against him, including burglary, battery, and assault, arguing the statute of limitations has run out. Charges originally were filed under John Doe. Now, Hansen's attorney also asked the judge for the second time for his conditions of release to be changed, saying the fact that a family member must supervise him at all times is inconvenient for his family. Brittany addressed the court, pleading with the judge not to change a thing. I've had my family watch me for 10 years. I think it's inconvenient. It was inconvenient, sorry, for my family to do so, yet he's wanting some leniency, which I don't think that serves. Now, Judge Cindy Leos ultimately decided to keep Hansen's conditions the same and will not drop the charges. Back to you. Okay, thanks, Fernanda. Now, another motion by the defense was an extension to conduct witness interviews. They would like to bring in an expert on memory loss to testify. The judge did grant that motion and gave them 30 extra days.